Right, so that's freed them up. It's this mess up here that I don't like. So we've got 960 coming off this same circuit. 960. Wait, why is this connected in? What the fuck is going on here? 1905. So that's this and then all the planty related stuff. Okay. Two five eighty. There's a lot of power to have in one circuit. So why is this? It's got all this crap. So it's all this crap. Right, let's let's get rid of this. I really wish I'd not got rid of all this ladder that I've been systematically getting rid of. Um makes me a wee bit sad. We can put this circuit, which is all this crap. There shouldn't be anything else on this, I don't think. We can put that on one of these bottom circuits, which will be nice. so long. Okay, so that'll reclaim that. Two more that we can use down here. This one's got a couple of things on it, but that's fine. Uh, let's actually connect this pump up whilst we're waiting, so this can be. Um Starting to cycle some water through. Set up some food tasks and get to sleep. Good night. Take it easy, Leppy. Good to see you. And thank you again for all the bits, buddy. Really is appreciated. Um, you'll have to let me know on. Put on the Discord which server you're on. Although I think come Friday we'll probably end up playing on the uh, on Blues one, won't we? I am just getting a bit of withdrawals from playing that game. It's very enjoyable. Very relaxing. Very nice. Okay, this is nice and cold. For now, this is nice and cold. Uh, right. I do want to seal this bottom area off soon. I don't really want them coming and walking across here at all. So let me get the rest of this wiring in. Um, so there's two more circuits in theory, isn't there? We'll save this one for stuff down here eventually. And then these these last two, let's put them towards the base. I think. Uh, so you're going to come up here. Then you're going to come up 
here. Start digging some more iron out. We've used a fuck ton of iron in this map. Uh, what is this? Where did this crap come from? Uh, we've used a lot of iron. Which is fine. I'd rather use iron than wolframite or gold whenever we can. But still, we've used a shit ton. There's some left up here. Not much. Big old bit of it there though. Let's get in here. Let's get in here and start digging some of this out. Some sleep wheat, or was that fertilizer? Have we, have we had some sleep wheat fall off yet? I don't, I don't think we have. Oh no, this is fertilizer. Okay, that's fine. I want some sleep wheat. I want to test the theory whether it will actually merge nicely on the conveyor lines. <coughs> I don't really care about um, gases outside the base anymore. We've got that much oxygen outside the base now, well we did have anyway. Um, that things will just find their natural homes now. Look at all these packets jiggling around. It's like looking at a petri dish. Uh, likewise, I should probably get rid of some of this carbon dioxide we've got down here. I've just sort of left it on this side of the base, like it is what it is, but I should probably get rid of it at some point. Um, okay, let's figure, finish doing these wires. Uh, we will actually I'll hook this up now, even though we don't need it, so that we've got it for later. And. Someone as the hypothermia. Two forty four eighty nine sixty. Right, this sh this should have its own circuit. So we'll use this for one of these. Uh... All right, I'm back. He wants to touch me. <laughs> Sunday. Form an orderly queue, everyone. He's back. And nubbins be needing touchins. This fucking ladder, I've built it about 17 times now. Right, up here, up here. Uh, up here, up here. Fine, do that. Hey, Q Zone, good evening, buddy. How's it going? Uh, what do you think about the gas overlay mod? Uh, the onion patcher mod, you mean? Onion skin thing. Uh, it looks really nice. Saturnus pointed out to me a while back. Um, it looks really nice, but I'm begrudged to put mods in the game uh, until it's like intended features. Just because I'm a little bit scared of corrupting save files and stuff. Um, it's useless. Uh, it looks quite nice. It, it reminds me of what the gas overlay used to look like. When you used to click on this overlay back in the day, like when the game first came out, early early game, probably the first two updates maybe it was like this, 
all the gases were colour coded. It wasn't just red and shades of blue and purple. Like oxygen was blue, polluted oxygen was yellow. The gases were colour coded in here, which made it really easy at a glance to see what what gases were. Like I, I don't know what this stuff is here because it's not, you know, I don't know what the gases are between these bands of of oxygen, for example, at a glance. I, I do know what they are, but I would be able to see them colour coded, which I think is what they were trying to bring back with that that mod. And it is incredibly helpful, but I've just I've not bothered with it to be honest. So Turner's mentioned it to me a little while ago, and although it seems really snazzy. I just haven't bothered because I, I I don't want to lose like a a playthrough save that we're like twenty videos into or something like that for the sake of a mod. So when the game gets fully integrated mods, then I'll probably start using it or something like that because it's a feature I I do miss. Um, but for now, meh. Um, but good question, oh good. Is it something you use? Um, I'm debating putting these things on uh, this circuit, in case you're wondering what I'm um in an hour in it. I think I'll do that. Let's get rid of you and you and all of you actually. We can get a lot of metal back here. This is the other thing, I'm trying to regain some of our refined metal that we've just pissed away on clumsy wiring. So I can get a lot of this stuff back. And then just connect this to there, if you see what I mean. Right, so you'd be connected to there. You don't need to be deep destructed. You do. Yeah, I do miss the old uh, the old gas overlay. Let me see if I can find a picture for those of you that might not remember. Oh, well, here's a picture of... Uh, this is actually Saturnus's one. I know it's Saturnus. He's built stupid fucking hearts in his base because he loves hearts. Uh, if we go to the browser a second. He fucking loves hearts. Um, so this is this is sort of what he... What, this is what the onion skin patch has changed it to now. Um, which is quite nice. It's not what it used to be, but it's quite nice. I don't know. Um, I don't know how I'd go about finding the old one, to be honest. I don't know if I've got any pictures. Give me a sec. Uh, let me just turn this off a sec. Let's do some more again. I don't know if I've got any um, super old ones. Let's go back to the game for a sec, I'll see if I can find something. If you ever find it, send me a picture so I can reminisce. Probably find it by trolling the forums. Right, anyway, so we've got 
got loads of idle dupes. Um, okay. Uh, this can be connected to here. And then what are we at now? 1680. That's a nice circuit. 1940, that's a nice circuit. 1680, that's fine. 94, beautiful. This is very good. Okay. Just get a bit more of this dug out. We're not going to get all this done tonight, but I'll, I'll carry on d doing some of this digging and stuff. Um, just to give my dupe something to do, if nothing else. And now, um, I might do a little bit of digging off stream. If you want, just so I can get this cleared out, and then we'll be a bit further advanced for the next stream. I want to get this this colony wrapped up soon, so obviously we've got the update coming out pretty soonish, um, and I'd like to get I'd like to get this as a complete colony. I mean, realistically, we've got water, we've got food, um, we've got power. We're pretty good. The only thing I wanted to do last was build a uh, steam turbine setup, ideally, but it's going to take a lot of digging. A lot of digging. Oh, this is cooling down a little bit. This was at 27, it's now at 26.7, 26.6, 26.1. I think this was at like 27.2, 26.9. This is cooling down, this is nice. So I think if we ran this for another 15, 20 cycles, it'll probably uh, equalize out a little bit better. So changing this up definitely helped a little bit. Um, we'll get rid of this crap now. <clears throat> Got a few bits of solid uh, chlorine and solid carbon dioxide in the room, but I'm fine with that. I uh, don't know what we can do with this oil, because there's actually quite a bit there. Oh, nah. uh, we released some of this water down here, didn't we? Which is nice. Uh, you can go away. Can't really do much about you. We'll do a little priority three ladder, just to keep people busy. Venture down into the depths down here. There's lots of weasworts and stuff down here, and I've not really explored down here very much because it was. I dumped my polluted water in here right from the start of the game, really, because it was cold and it meant I could get rid of the germs. Um, I've literally just completely not bothered with this biome. It's a massive ice biome, like huge. So we just sort of left it. But we can get some of these weasworts, and there's probably lots of seeds and stuff down here. Um, and hopefully some wolframite as well. We need, do need some more wolframite. Yeah, it is. It is a whopper of an ice biome, you're right. We, we had two two massive ones. We've got this big bastard, and then we've got uh, this one up here. It's even bigger. Massive. But I think what, what basically happened in this world, Jim, we had lots and lots of ice biome and igneous biome and not very much slime, which is why I'm probably getting quite low on the old slime now, 23 tons. We had this little biome here. This was igneous. This was igneous. We've got a little slime biome here. And then, do you know what I mean? I, I like slime biomes. A lot of people avoid them, but I like them. Um, they give me a lot of good stuff. Oh no. Oh no. What happened here? How did this happen? What did you do? Hey, what are you doing down there? Yeah, I, I like slime biomes. They give you a lot of useful resources. Um, so yeah, not having them is, is kind of, it's a bit like having my hands tied. I like access to puffs and things like that as well. Like They're so useful. It's a bit of a funny one for me. Uh, now this oil level's dropped down, let's go for a wander over here as well. Because I kind of want to know what we've got over here. There's obviously some other pockets of oil and stuff. I just want to see what we've got. Um, we'll get this. We'll dig some more of this out, and then we'll drop the rest of this oil down as well. Because there's a lot of oil left up here. Beautiful. How many slicksters are in this little pocket? We've got like five in there. 
Oh no! I got another another one ready to pop. No. Oh. Shitload of diamond. That's nice. Uh, how do you control the germs? Uh, domineering, what I normally do is build a storage room full of chlorine and then just sweep up your slime as soon as you mine it. Um, put your slime underwater um, and then any materials that you get that are covered in germs you just put in your compact room and the chlorine just kills them off that easy. As long as you sweep up the sli uh, slime, like the debris slime that's on the floor, as long as you sweep that up very quickly, your slime lung is minimised to hardly anything. So, Buds of life is just pump oxygen in. Uh, no, that works for your base only half. So, um, if you do get slime lung in your base, as long as you keep your oxygen levels high, it, it dies off very quickly. So, we shouldn't have too much slime lung around the base. We've got a little bit up here, but it's negligible. It's a couple of thousand germs. Um, I mean, you can see on the map, we just you just kill it off, really. I mean, in fairness, a lot of the map is oxygenated. So, it just dies in oxygen. But the, the biggest thing is just sweep it up. Sweep up your... Um, sweep up your slime as soon as you mine it. As soon as you dig it out. Because it only emits germs when it's broken on the floor, if you like. Sweep and clean oxygen. Yeah, basically. You can, you can use temperature as well. I mean, cold works brilliantly. Um, that's why we normally, that's why I was, as I was just saying, this cold biome here is where I dumped all my dirty slimy water at the start of the game and now it's, there's no slime in here anymore, it's, it's killed everything off. So, but there is nothing worse than having a slime lung outbreak, I will say that, like, it's just the negatives are huge, but as long as you follow a few little precautions you should be alright. Um, the biggest killer I find with slime lung is the amount of CO2 that you get. If you get a, a slime lung outbreak in your base, the amount of oxygen that gets consumed and the amount of CO2 that gets produced, that's the killer. It's uh, often brutal. It has happened to me before, like I have lost people to slime lung. Um, but it's just one of those things I try and avoid as best I can. Oh, right. I wonder why they couldn't get up here anymore, it's because of this. Okay. No! No! We now got two stuck! No! Why? Why do they do this? Okay, I'm gonna go and have a nosy this way now. Um I was just taking a dump and remembered something that I've read somewhere some time ago. A fart is the horn of a shit train arriving at the ass station. Or the desperate scream of a trapped turd. Camo, that's that's very deep. <laughs> that's very, very deep. A little bit crude, but very, very deep. I can tell that one was straight from the heart. Jeez. <laughs> what the fuck? The horn of a shit train. Hey, listen. Top marks for originality, I mean, holy shit. Right, okay. Listen guys, I think we're at half eleven. I think I'm going to be done for the night now. Um, we, we've done a few things today. It doesn't look like it, but we've done a lot of tidying up. We've done um, a lot of tinkering with builds that have just been a bit broken for a while. This should hopefully settle down and should hopefully play nice. What I might do between now and the next stream is do a bit of tidying up. Do a bit more digging down here so that next stream we can maybe crack on with playing with a bit of magma and stuff. Um, so let's see, we're on 770 now. I might run for like 20, 30 cycles or something. Um, do a load of cleaning up. Do a load of digging down here. Um, and yeah, I think I think that'll do us. Um, we have fixed a few of the annoying bugs as well. Uh, Scout Mercenary Man, thank you very much for the follow, buddy. Welcome to the stream. Um, we have fixed a number of annoying little bugs as well that have plagued us for a while. This this intermittent power gen problem we had earlier was really annoying, but that should hopefully be fixed. So power-wise, we're actually not too bad again. We're, we're still getting a positive natural gas. Um, 
We're still using a bit of hydrogen, but this is on the rise again. The only thing we're using a, a lot of is coal, but we're still at 12 tons of coal at the minute as well. So that's rising too. Um, so I think we're a pretty stable base-wise now. So it'll all be about dicking about with steam next stream, I reckon. So if you want to see me messing about with steam turbines, please tune in next time. Uh, it will be Thursday now, 7 p.m. GMT. I'm out tomorrow for mother's birthday. Um, so it'll be Thursday, 7 p.m. GMT. If you haven't already, please do stop by the Discord as ever. Um, you're always very welcome there with any questions or any uh, funny things you think I might enjoy. Because I do like funny things. Let's just go to the end stream. And let's see if... The credit's going to play nice this time. Do, do, do. Germs is always the problem to me. Makes me lose my base very often. Oh, that sucks. Well, try those steps, Domineering. Try those steps. See if it makes a difference to you. Okay. Um, so, as ever, thank you very much to my mods tonight. We had uh, Hanno in for a little bit. We had QWERTY. Don't know where Max was. He's probably sleeping, I reckon. Um, but much love as ever. Oh, and GG popped in as well. Um, so thank you very much to my mods. Uh, for the bits, Lepi, Sindane, Hanno, really appreciated. Thank you guys. Uh, for the follows, uh, Scout Mercenary Man, Demi Rogers, uh, Mongo, Paranoid, Killer Dreams. Thank you, thank you, thank you. And for the sub, Lepi, mwah, much love, buddy. Um, yeah, guys, it'll be Thursday, 7 p.m. GMT. Probably going to try and get this colony finished, so tune in on Thursday. Mm -hmm. That's me for the night. Guys, much love. Have a lovely evening, afternoon, morning. Bye. 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 Mwah.